What's good guys? Welcome back to Ron's Rise News. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where we finally got Scuderia Ferrari's new F175, the most anticipated Formula One car ahead of the 2022 season. It just broke cover a few minutes ago with a red and black livery reminiscent of the team's F1 challengers of the late 1980s and early 1990s. Now the Ferrari F175 is definitely a looker and the team can only hope that it is as fast as it looks. To finally get the Scuderia out of the doldrums, it's been languishing and for years now, with 2020 being particularly painful and 2021 delivering a semi-revival in the form of third in the F1 Constructors Championship. Now, Ferrari and its management team have been very vocal about going all in this year, trying to benefit from the clean slate the 2022 F1 regulations presented, which will definitely put more pressure on them to deliver as they have sacrificed previous campaigns to focus on 2022. Now, the F175's name carries great prominence as it celebrates the occasion when the first ever Ferrari production car left the company's factory in March 75 years ago, but more importantly, the team's 68th single-seater represents the hope of Ferrari's return where it belongs at the sharp end of F1 proceeds. Nothing less than winning will be acceptable. Now for that, the team can rely on one of the most, if not the most exciting driver pairings on the F1 grid. Charles Leclerc, Ferrari's chosen one, and Carlos Sainz, the newcomer who wasted no time establishing himself as a force to be reckoned with with his new team. Now both drivers combined with massive talent and experience by now are undoubtedly able to deliver the goods should the F-175 turn out to be a quick car and by that take the fight to the likes of Mercedes and Red Bull who are naturally the favorites, thus delivering a 2022 F-1 season that overshadows a 2021 campaign that set the benchmark high in terms of excitement, controversy, and unpredictability. And with the new livery features like the black front and the rear wings, as well as the black halo, black number on both the nose and the engine cover and the celebrating 75 years logo ferrari has all the ambition they need to have a beautiful f1 season for 2022 but with that said what do you guys think about ferrari's new f175 for the 2022 formula one season let me know down in the comments below and if you guys did enjoy the video today make sure you give it a big thumbs up giving the video a like will help get it up in the rankings more people can see it and we can have a bigger discussion on the new f175 formula one race car out of marinello now, as I said, if you guys want to help further support the channel, always check the links down below. I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, my Cash App, and my Venmo. Just in case you guys want to donate a dollar or two to the channel, I appreciate the love and support. Thank you so much, guys. You can also check out the Ron's Rise merch just in case you guys want some stickers, coffee mugs, backpacks, Kango hats, everything Ron's Rise is there. And I'm also on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. See everything I'm posting, Ferrari, Maserati, and Alfa Romeo that doesn't always make it here to the channel. Now make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, but click that notification bell so you don't miss one video. With that said, you guys be blessed, have a great day, and we will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise video. Peace.